Hello everyone, GameDog here, and welcome! Let's play After the End, The Harvest. A sci-fi RPG maker game in which you can explore a galaxy after most of humanity has disappeared. It's a very interesting looking game, and uh, by the way, this is also an early access as well, so if some things seem a little off, uh, that's why. I can already tell you that looks a little bit strange, the square islands. Anyway, anyway. Probably shouldn't be complaining in like the first minute. Anyway, incoming transmission. Um, La Lanui? Lani? Okay, can you hear me? This also uses your mouse too, which is something I don't really see that often. Council leader, what is it? Council leader, come in. Be careful, something is interfering with your ship. It can't be. Please be careful. Oh no. I better prepare myself. My weapons are inside the lock um the lockers within the cargo bay. I should use the wasp arrow keys to walk and enter or left click to interact. If you want to run, you can use the shift key. I can't run for long or else I get tired enough though. Uh, that's a typo. Should be an apostrophe there. Areas that can be interacted with will also change my mouse cursor. I should keep an eye out. Okay. Um I use the arrow keys too. Okay, good. Whoa! Diagonal movement? Oh, that's not something you see often. Huh. Oh. Ship cargo bay currently unlocked. Weapons currently being held within the lockers. Oh, there's the shift key. Okay. Energy sword level um, X1. Hello, my old friend. Press the eye or the icon, um, yeah, or the icon top right of the screen to, uh, um, to access your inventory. That's not in the top right. Oh, it's probably an arrow deciding where I need to go next. Anyway, select the equip button from your inventory. Main weapons can be used by clicking the corresponding icon on the hotbar or by pressing the corresponding number. Okay. Uh, so inventory. There we go, that's cool. Oh, this is a cool t uh, little screen right here. I like this a lot. Um, what the? Oh, interesting. There are secondary weapons. What's this? Like abilities. That's kind of cool. I guess I'll learn about that later. Whoa! Oh, that's really powerful looking. All right. What's this green arrow? A lot of Ankai preferred energy-based weapons. I prefer the classic metal feel of the human-made shotguns. Rusty shotgun. All right, there we go. Secondary weapons. Hmm. Oh. Oh no. This ship has not been authorized for flight within the sector. You have no um. You have no authority over the. Okay, as per usual with games with no voice acting, I'm gonna have a little bit of trouble with proper nouns. Um, Anukai, I think is how I'm gonna pronounce it for now, though. Let's click to the corresponding key to attack. Okay, can I equip my gun first? Um, there we go. All right. So I got 25 shots in that. All right, so go ahead and attack this thing. I'm imagining. No? Maybe I gotta shoot it. Huh? The controls are a bit strange, but I, I, I it seems like the kind of thing I can get used to. Do I have to attack you? Oh yes, I do. Okay. Oh, this is interesting. Um. Okay, it looks like the walls block my bullets. Oh, there we go. Probably don't want to waste those too much, though. Okay, looks like there's a little bit of a range to it. It's holding up a shield. Is he blocking? Oh, I evaded that somehow. Yep, he does block. Okay. Let's try to retreat for a little bit. There we go. Alright, I think I'm getting this. Oh, oh, there we go. This is wrong. You cannot just board my ship. Your ship has been marked as, as a possible enemy against the Federation. We are required uh, by the Keepers Galactic Law to neutralize this ship. That was the wrong two, I believe, too. Um, the Keepers, are you there? Oh no, more enforcers. Equip some skills from your inventory to deal with the mobs. Alright, so inventory. 
skills. Okay, so here's where these are. Let's see. Oh, this is really interesting. I like this a lot. I can put that in 5, 6, and 7. I wonder what 3 and 4 are going to be, because I couldn't put them there. Maybe items. Oh, no, no. Um. Oh, I can put them here. Oh, it's all the same weapon, though. That's kind of bizarre, but, um... I those are going to come in later. Let's see. What's the F key do? Nothing from what I see so far. Maybe it's just an interact button. Oh, no, no, no. Ah, there we go. Whoa. <laughs> Might as well try out all the skills while I'm here. Oh, wow. Oh, I froze them. Huh. Lower is now for level 2. Or Lonnie. Wait. Oh. Choose your level up bonus. Bonuses are permanent and immediate. You will gain a small boost to your attribute that you choose. Odd critical hit. Attack hit rate. Magic attack. Mana. Let's see. Um. Let's just go for raw power for now. Yeah, there we go. This is very cool. I like this a lot so far. It's a little rough around the edges, but then again, early access, you kind of have to expect that. Ooh, select your care of the arrow keys. Um, none of these look like me at all. I'll, I'll play as Garrett here from Golden Sun. Yeah, we'll do that. Un, yeah. Unul. Um, let's see. Wait, I can't use my backspace here? That's kind of strange. Oh boy, um, how do I backspace? Oh, like that, okay. Let's see. G, A, M, U, no, no, no. Do it this way. <laughs> I'm more used to doing it this way. I'm not used to using my mouse of RPG Maker games. There we go, game dog. Oh, no, no. Oh my goodness, okay. Oh yeah, there we go. This is automatic, by the way. Um, let's see. Sarah's village discovered. What the? Oh, uh, I get a dog. Uh. What am I usually? Okay, whenever I play these games, I usually name my sidekick. Um, let's see. Whenever I play video games, I usually name my Psychic Hero for some reason. I just like that name a lot. Alright, so I get a pet dog. Um, let's see. Did you see that? You know, I really love the mug shots in this game, too. They're really well detailed. Some sort of ship just flew over our village. I think it crashed just past the forest upside of town. Or outside of town. I want uh, you to go have a look, but I know that you are good with weapons. I'm really scared of the monsters in the forest. I don't want to deal with them, um, with them ever again. Could you and your companion go have a look? Here, take my potions. These will help the, the HP um, of you and your companion. You can click the menu icon on the side of the screen, or press the I to open your inventory and equip them. If you have the materials, you can also craft your own potions, as well as many other things. Oh, this is a crafting system. You should probably get yourself some sort of weapon. I'm sure there's something inside of your house that you could use. Make sure to check all the boxes and cabinets. Who knows what, you, what, uh, what might be lying around. If you're brave, you can always make your companions attack you, um, for you by pressing F. Oh, that's what that does. Okay. Just please don't accidentally press F and make him attack the villagers again. But, so you can do that. Okay. Oh. Huh. So there's like a there's like a Xenoblade style. That's cool. Okay. The controls are in my inventory. Crash site register on the map. There's a map? That's neat. Okay. Press escape to view the map. And a save plus one. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's a pretty big world. Crash site. I'm assuming that's where I need to go next. Okay. Got a save plus one. What's that do? Open up the uh, menu. Use to save your progress. Um, That's kind of interesting that it's an item in this game. I like that the controls are an item. Like, w whenever it comes to a game that doesn't play like it normally does in the engine, you kind of need the ability to... I keep doing that. You kind of need the... Wait, what? I jumped for some reason. Why am I jumping? 
Huh, that's kind of strange. Alright, let's, let's search around for a little bit, I guess. Um, let's see. Arrows. Look more like wands, personally, but, um... A spell herb. Oh, log five. I wonder if those are, like, the Ansem reports or something. Let's see, let me walk through my cabinet real quick. Um... Slashing dagger, that's a weapon. I'm explore everything, though. Okay, let's open this up. There we go. I'm still very, very used to, um, to using I to open the menu. Uh, let's see. Well, let's... Okay, so now there's a gun in here somewhere. Spell herb. I gotta find out what that does real quick. Woods? And that appears to be it. Okay. Oh, I didn't even see the gun case right here. Hunting rifle. And ten bullets. Okay, I'll loot my house first and then I'll equip everything. Mana potion. Spin ball flail. I don't know if that's like a pike ball or something. Kind of looks like one. Crafting kit. The crafting kit enables you to craft items wherever you are. You can also use this table to craft different items and weapons. Ooh, okay. So this is what I can craft. Oh, okay, that makes sense. I'm assuming I can't really make much right now. What if you get, like, recipes later in? Uh, wait. Alchemy. Spaceship fuel. Huh. That's kind of cool. What, what's this? Um, baits? Those are necklaces. Wait. You know, the icons in this game are a little strange to me right now. Some of them... The game uses a lot of sprites that I've seen so far that are, like, default RPG Maker stuff. Um, I don't need to... Wait, there's a time system? Oh my goodness, there's a lot in this game. Deadly Flail Constructive Basic Metal. What if I can... How do I tell which one is more powerful? So that one looks... That one sounds stronger. Um, there must be a way. Just not seeing it so far. Might as well equip that. If you're... Okay, one small problem I have right now... I'm trying to hit left right here, but because my mouse is on secondary, it's going to keep uh, going back to secondary. That strikes me as something that could be very difficult to fix, but it, it it's kind of annoying. Okay, I wonder if I can choose to... Oh yeah, especially in situations like that, like, how am I supposed to go up here? So I'm hitting up over and over again. Wait, what? Wait... Oh, that's a glitch. Look at that. I hit up and it it's up on the... Huh. Okay, well, let's just put those in for now. Put the mana potion on, too. What else we got? Receives... Treats me, uh... uh treats many stats and ones can be planted. Receives plus three when harvesting. Plus three what? And... Uh, plate of something. Can't really tell because of that weird glitch. Okay. Let's see. Alright, flint, mana powder, there's a lot to take in when it comes to, um, to your controls. Oh, you jump whenever you go on and off the snow, okay, I figure it out now. The gun shop right here, I don't think I have much money. Is that a pig? Whoa! Um, Bergia Arms Merchant. Did you hear that crash? I hope we get some new customers. <laughs> okay, um. Oh, wow. Isn't that what I have? No, I have the hunting rifle. Wait, that's what, I think that's what that woman at the beginning of the game had. Metal casing, I can make bullets with that. Arrowheads? Oh, you know, the fact that I got arrowheads makes me think that there's, like, crossbows in this game. Uh, okay, um, let's see. Can I loot this man in any way? Uh, yes, I can. Why not what you want to do. Talk to you again. There we go. You have to face someone physically in order to get the in order to uh, to to talk to them, which again is very difficult to get used to. Random. Okay, I found a nickel on the ground. Basically, high potion. Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. That that's where you cross the line when it comes to me stealing from you. All right. Um. Oh, well, the game's a bit laggy right now. Um. Mr. Kitty, where are you? Slime it up? Wait, what is that? Oh man, so many items in this game. Um. Uh, okay, that seems like something I would sell. That doesn't look too reliable. Actually, given how this game controls, I can very easily see, um... I uh, see Confusion doing nothing more than, like, reversing my controls or something. Which, honestly, is, is, 
easy to get used to. Only the best uh, brood for brood from the worst. I like that logo. Um, let's see. Wolf revive, poison, elixir. Okay, that's fine. The people in the village can be pretty close-minded compared to the to the ones in the rest of the universe. A spaceship flies overhead, and the whole town goes crazy. Maybe it's something from my home planet of uh, of Hopa. You know, given that this is sci-fi, I can see it being kind of a common occurrence. Ether ammo. What is that? Um. I don't have a map for this area. No, I'm trying to open the... There we go. Uh, would it be a weapon? Ooh. Oh, no, it's right there. Ammo for energy-based weapons. Probably like ray guns or something. Hmm, okay. Move on. The diagonal movement is pretty interesting. That's kind of hard to pull off an RPG maker from what I've seen. The screen's getting darker for some reason. Alright, there's a day-night cycle. Alright, who's this nerd? Come on. <laughs> Wait, where are his glasses? Um, the people here just don't seem to understand how big this universe really is. Okay. Aiming for older rifles and shotguns. I like that they call them older rifles, too. Eye potion. Flint and arrows. Okay, can't wait to find like a bow or something. Because I got a ton of arrows for them right now. Okay. Oh, that's a okay. Uh hero, go. Go, go. Okay. Oh wow. Oh, it's like a spinning attack. Um maybe I shouldn't have this equipped right now. Whoa! That is the most over-the-top death animation I've ever seen. Um <laughs> Uh, I got hit a lot there. Let's just buff up toughness, I guess. There we go. Oh, I got two level ups somehow. Let's see. Raw health. Whenever I play these kinds of games, you're gonna notice that I, um... That's good. Okay, you're gonna notice that, um... I try to go for, um... There we go. Oh, that missed him. Uh, what is this thing? Okay, I can see this being a game kind of hard to commentate over just by the sheer amount of stuff that's going on. Wait, what? I died. Was I supposed to not go down that way yet? Um, let's see. Alright, so I played around to the point at which I died last time. I'm not going to go down there quite yet. I'm going to see, um... I'm going to maybe explore a little bit first. Uh, maybe see if maybe there are, like, some side quests up here I can do or something to make me a little bit stronger for those enemies. Because I, didn't, I did not expect to die the second enemy in the game. While playing through the game again, I noticed that, um... Well, while playing up to this point again, I noticed that I got some different weapons. Uh, like, for example, I found a steel axe as well as that, like, weird ball and chain thing. Um, I also found a bunch of this as well, and, um... Like I say, I, I just found, like, different items, which is interesting. Seems like the game is somewhat randomly generated, which is, which is cool. How does this weapon work? Okay, that seems a lot more reliable than the, uh, than the weird ball and chain thing. Mr. Kitty, where are you? Okay, where is that guy? That seems like a prime first, uh... That seems like a prime first, uh, first mission right there. Maybe I can talk to him or something. Was that a flying machine? I've never seen one in my entire life. Oh, come on. What was, what was that noise? It shook my whole house. I think my poor kitty, uh, got out. Could you have a, um, could you go have a look for my kitty? Uh, sure, let's do that. We get two potions. Uh, and we actually got some experience for that, too. Storage site just down the path. Okay, so there's a quest log. Huh. Missing feline. Now, I'm not going to untrack that. I'm not going to abandon it, certainly. Let's see. East of the village. Okay, I probably wouldn't have guessed that. Because given the fact that she walks around randomly, it seems like something, uh, like, say she could have, like, spawned on the other side of town. Get away from her crops. Okay, so there appear to be a lot of missions in this game. I'm going to go this way this time, though. Those blasted slimes have ruined our crops. We all worked so hard to maintain these crops, and now look at them. They're all slimy. Please help, I know you used to quite um you um you used to be quite proficient within the range of weapons. Yeah, we'll do that too. Speaking of quests, I'm not hundred percent sure if this is gonna be a one hundred percent run of or anything. Again, not everything is in the game yet, uh, considering that it is early access right now, so I'm not even sure if like everything is in the game yet. See, I'll use some bullets. Oh, there's one. Got three bolts from him. 
Okay, that's a little bit annoying. How you um, how the game like pauses you, um, when uh, whenever you uh, whenever you kill an enemy, and uh, get an item from them. Okay, why am I missing this fool? Get out of here. Nice. Okay. Um, let's go for a raw health this time. I I, I think I'm gonna try and go for the exact same level ups I got beforehand. So toughness again. Wait, I have 800 health. That gave me like um. Doing that in particular gave me like gave me like three health or something. Maybe that wasn't the best idea. Um, is that all the slimes I gotta worry about? Let's go try and talk of her again. Nope. Oh, come on. Thank you so much, Wanderer. Now you can safely get. Uh, now we can safely get back to tending our food. We have to. Yeah, we have to grow our own food these days. It's funny that something called the harvest could leave us so empty. Nice. Okay. Level 3. Hero is level 3. Quest logs are so handy. I can easily tell what quests are easy, medium, or difficult based on the level. Oh, there's a levels? I didn't even notice that. Quest marked of a 1 are easy, 2 are average, and 3 are difficult. Quest marked of 1 are easy, 2 are average, and 3 are difficult. You just said that. Huh, okay. Let's see. Attack hit rate. I, that sounds interesting. Wait, wait, wait. I wish it told you what it did, because attack hit rate could mean a lot of things, from what I see. Oh, we both level up. I never noticed that beforehand. Okay, I'm gonna go for raw damage on him then, because that's all he seems to be doing right now. I also named him Hero again. Honestly, I love that name for a sidekick for whatever reason. Okay. Uh, what are these things? Oh man, they're like, uh, they're like, okay, um... You have to physically face an enemy too in order to attack it, which is kind of interesting. Let's see. As soon as I don't have any skills yet. Oh, that's the monster that killed me last time. Um, maybe I should retreat for now. Like, try to kill a bunch of them from a distance. I don't want to take out this guy yet, though, because he killed me last time. Oh, you know what I should do? I'm going to save my game real quick. <laughs> there we go. They have 2,000 health, though. Oh, they're shooting something at me. Uh, that almost killed me. Use my potion. There we go. That heals both of us, which is good. It seems like they can only go after me from a different range. Yeah, they're not attacking me now, which means I could probably just kill them this way. Probably a waste of bullets, but as you can see right there, they can kill me very easily. Oh, no, this one's interested now. Come on. Uh-oh. Uh, move out of the way before he fires that. What's my dog doing? Oh, I found an arrowhead. Ether ammo, and uh, some potions right there, too. Okay. Oh, there we go. Okay, good. Let's see. Let's go for... We don't have any magic yet. Maybe this is a character who doesn't really use magic that much. Let's go for chance. I like critical hit ratios. Uh, and he leveled up two. Yeah, only three more health. That's not that great. We'll just go for power on him for the time being. I, I, I kind of wish it was more obvious who was leveling up, because that confused me the first time. Asterix Pit. Like, maybe if, like, they put the character's mugshot next to who actually leveled up, that would have been a bit more, um, it would make it a bit more simple. Okay, this looks like a place I shouldn't be at yet. Um, can I even walk on this? Yeah, I can. Oh, look at the little baby ones. Um, oh boy. Okay, maybe I shouldn't be here. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna retreat for now. This game is a lot more, is a bit more difficult than I expected. Wait, why am I here now? That's not where that led before. Am I stuck here? Okay, might as well send my dog out to do some work. Uh, let's see. Oh, that looks like a prime opportunity for my shotgun. Yeah, it's hitting both of them now. Let's see. Oh, there we go. Found some steel rods. Not sure if that's good or not. I'm poisoned. Man, there's a lot going on in this game at, at all times, which is kind of ridiculous. Alright, bullets. That's good. I stunned him. Nice, okay. Flamethrower fuel. There's a flamethrower in this game, that's cool. I like flamethrower weapons. Uh, you can go after... go after that fool. I wanna see what's in the here. Here we go. I, uh, oh, oh boy, uh, potion. I almost died there again. Wait, my dog died! Oh, um... Oh no. Alright, potion, potion, just potion for now. Um, 
Go back to I no no no. Go back to items. Alright, where is it? Was there like a dog treat here or something that like revived the guy? Revives a fallen ally. There we go. Um, let's see, go back in. Oh, I have a wait, I didn't have these last time. Or maybe I did and I just wasn't paying attention. Let's see, let's put wave right there. That right there. Let's survive our dog. Oh, okay, he's gonna jump on over. <laughs> That's kinda silly. What's his health like? I wish I could see his health at all times. I noticed his health bar was up earlier. Uh-oh. Oh, okay, now I leveled up. Man, there's a lot going on in this game at once. Well, now that I know that I have magic, I might as well use it. Um, we'll keep buffing up your power. That seems to be what he does best. I might go for toughness next. Oh, he died again. Oh, come on. There we go. Alright, um... Five again. There we go. What's his health? I need to see that. Um, What's this? Guard up. Interesting. Could be good for like a boss. Spacesuit. I don't have a space. What's a space? Well, I know what a spacesuit is, but why would I need one in this game? I'll do that. He's probably low on health. Maybe it's like a Phoenix down where we're rising with like half health or something. Or like a revive from Pokemon. Am I going in circles? Kind of feels like I am. Yeah, I think I am. Okay, I, I probably have to go down. Well, I didn't expect to be forced down here. Um, let's go ahead and use some of our skills. No, no, I didn't mean to do that. Oh my goodness, okay. Oh. Ah, whatever. Okay. Go to the inventory. I'm gonna replace the, um... Do I have a healing thing? Or a, uh, an MP restore thing? I don't think I do. Let's see. Nah, I'm not gonna use it quite yet. Okay, we'll just we'll just attack these guys normally for the time being. They don't seem to do that much damage. That I can stun them half the time anyway. Elf hero attack. Okay. Alright, arrows. What is healing these guys? Because I see like these little effects going on around them. Oh, he's all in health again. Okay. There we go. Flower seed in full potion. It's so hot. Oh. Oh. This is like a heat wave from Golden Sun. Uh, let's see. It's like the Lamakin Desert. Oh, wow. How do I get out of here? I'm gonna try and just run for now. Like, don't think I could live in, in, in this heat. Whoa, what? Wait, why am I on the ceiling? It, I know, I know. Hmm. Maybe I am supposed to die. Yeah, I'm gonna let myself be defeated for now. Man, oh my god, look at all these effects, like my goodness. Okay, okay. <laughs> I think my last save point, or my last uh, reload point was, um, was like outside this area? Yeah, this is much more, more manageable. I think I'll explore in the other direction for now. Okay, get the ammunition. There we go. Okay, pick that up. Have I talked to you in this in this in this uh, separate timeline yet? Oh, no. Okay, what is my dog doing? Oh, that's a bit strange. Oh, he's attacking that guy. Let's heal up again. I'm using those a lot. I noticed. All right, steel rod. Oh, and level up. Let's see. I'm gonna go for intelligence. And for the dog, uh, we'll go for toughness because he he dies a lot in that area. I don't think I'm gonna go back down there yet though. Let's see if I. Oh, come on. Yeah, I'll go ahead and put these on. Let's see, fire on five, wave on six. Okay, that's a bit more reliable for me. Um, okay. Let's try firing this. Oh. Uh-oh.
I noticed I can shoot my gun and attack at the same time. That's kind of cool. Laser ammo? Okay. That guy dropped two items. Uh, uh oh. Okay. Get my, get my face, wolf. There we go. Let's see. Um, heal up. Then we'll try. Oh, there's an item here. Might as well pick that up. Wolf potion. And all these items, I gotta look up what they do. Ooh, that's good. Makes sense, too, being called that. Is that an enemy? That's no, just a random mount of. Can I examine that? No, I can't. Okay. We'll keep going down. Oh! Okay, I can kill this rabbit for some reason. Got some gold from it. He didn't attack me back, though. I wonder if I was supposed to do that. There's something really satisfying about bum-rushing enemies in this game. I know it's probably not the way I'm supposed to play, but it's effective. Yeah, just like ram right into them, attacking. Man, I'm enjoying this so far. Whoa. Gods? Goods for sale. Oh, come on. Why can't I talk to you? There we go. Just another day in the open road. May, um, how I praise the privileged, uh, um, yeah, the privilege of life. Uh, let's see, how many do I have? I have nine, that's enough for now. Ancient fossils, steel rods, I got one of those. That's enough for now, okay. I'm part of the Syria Trades, um, Traders Network. We serve as the messengers and salespeople between the various races of, of, uh, of this planet. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, I would like to check something real quick. Oh. Where's the crafting box? I do have it, right? Huh, maybe I don't. My thing was, I, I have collected some things. Maybe I can actually drain. Okay. There we go. Maybe I can actually, um, uh, make some things now. Like, maybe. Maybe I can. Okay. I killed him just as he was about to drain me. Man, my dog can really leap. What's wrong with this ship? Okay, that is like a flat-up alien. Um, oh, what's this flare scarf right here? What is that? Um, water? Okay, that that was effective. Whatever it did. Whoa! Uh, was that enemy invisible? Wait. Demonoid. Okay, um, interesting. What's in here? Hello. Oh, you're an enemy! Um, I, I saw someone in, like, a tent, and I thought they were a good guy. Um, there is, like, a shop or something. Get out of here. Oh, I learned thunder. Yeah, I, I can see myself using these a lot more. I'll go ahead and boost that up. That's for y'all just go for toughness again. I'll go for, like, critical chance next or something. Laser ammo. Convenient that we found that in a box. Um, antidote. Hmm. Let's see. Let's go ahead and equip that. Is that all that's here? Or in this area? These, like, uh, these, like, teepee things? Oh, that looks a little bit ugly. Look at that. Huh. You know, one thing I've learned when it comes to, um... Uh, when it comes to game development is that you want to focus on the big things first and then the fine details later. Whenever I play... Uh, by the way, I do see the aliens down there. I just want to keep running around real quick. Whenever it comes to... Like, I notice that that mentality is mostly, um... Apparent in, a uh, in early access games like this. Honestly, if this was finished, I imagine something like that would... What is that? Huh. That looks like two different art styles right there. Yeah, whatever. Let's see. I think I'm gonna save real quick. Who knows if this might be a boss battle or something? Might as well. I should really be using, like, the multiple save files in case one of these messes up. They gave you 16 for a reason. 
Is the ship the st the ship is still warm? The owner will probably come back soon. Wait, aren't these the owners right here? Human, bah. We don't uh, we don't mean to show our presence to to you people just yet. Please don't inform your townspeople of our avail. I don't think they um they are ready to accept the real truth. Uh, why are you here? Deaf to humans. Oh, okay, that's blunt. Um. In time, human. In time. First, we need to uh, your help repairing our ship. Well, I probably shouldn't, but um, the game's probably not going to let me progress until I do. Some sort of magnetic explosion disabled our navigation and sent us plummeting towards this pitiful planet. We're, we've been stuck here since. I don't think we can survive here much longer. We need um, sustenance. Uh, sustenance. Human, are you loyal? Do you embrace your love vibration of friendship towards your townsmen? Uh, love vibrations? <laughs> Perfect. You have no idea what what a love vibration is. You'll do perfectly. Oh, okay. Um, I request that you bring me one of your townsmen. What? We must feed. The energy of human is essential for us. Use this to damage and capture a human. Human. Once uh, we've caught one, bring it back to us. Be careful on uh, letting them out. Humans have a tendency of attacking their captors. Uh. Do I want to do this? Deaf to humans. Do I have a choice? What does I say the other option here? That is pity. Um, that is a pity. I would I would have liked to ask you uh, for your aid, but now it seems you must uh, feed on. We must feed on you instead. Deaf to humans. Oh, okay, okay. Um, let's see. Vade and miss. Oh. Uh oh. There we go. Okay, so it looks like we can kill these guys. Maybe these are the first boss. Uh, this, is, this is the first boss. You can very easily see that. You know what? Wait a second. Open the inventory. Go to items. I got this a little while ago. Let's have, wait. Where to go? Where's that attack up thing or defense up thing? I want to use that. Oh, there's a crafting kit. All right, we'll, we'll just go out for now. Um, I'll use shotgun blasts. There you go, hero. You can do your thing. Come on. There we go. Oh, okay. Elixir. That restores all, uh, all magic, I believe, but it looks like we're almost done with this, so maybe I don't need to do it. I'm out of ammo bullets, though. I'm gonna have to go melee at this point. He's like five hits away from death, though. I'm gonna play it safe, heal up. There we go. Okay. Can I get that? I hope I can get that. I can't get that. Ah, must got shoved into an area or into the water or something. I, I killed the owners. Okay, now what? Huh. Hero, what do you think we should do? Um. Interesting. I guess I'll just explore around a little bit more until then. I'll save my game. Just cause. There we go. Okay. Oh, uh, there's that again. Yeah, those scorpions, these scorpions are tough. I keep missing him for some reason. My dog is about to die. No, he didn't. Okay, good. I'll use that wolf potion. There we go. Okay. Hey, you get over here. Uh, let's see. Did you see uh, where the ship crashed? Ah, answer me. If you go anywhere near that ship, I will have no choice but to arrest you under law of the keep. Well, I wish you told me that before I killed them. Uh. Okay. I, do I have any option but to go near the ship now or something? Wait a second. Okay. You know what I really want to do right now? Storage site. Oh, this is where that that uh, that cat is. What the? Who's this dead guy? Oh. Uh oh. Um. Okay, let's heal up for now. Still got plenty of potions. 
There we go. Okay. That's locked. Maybe you could craft something to open the lock. Okay, we'll, we'll worry on that later. Um, what is that? Uh, like a giant Trent. Um, let's see. Oh my goodness, Trent is angry. Let's get out of here. Mr. Kitty, where are you? He's being guarded by by Lord Oak himself. Okay, let's um Let's go back this way for now. I'm gonna heal up, actually. <laughs> Can't run in the snow for some reason. What the Okay, um Man, there is too much going on in this game. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's a problem though, or just me being slow, but whatever. Um, we'll sleep for now. Let's see, let's jump back out. And you know what? I think it's enough for one episode. I mean, this game is pretty fun. Um, I think I'll go ahead and return this a little bit later, so... Actually, no, what I'm saying, I'm once playing the game for now. I want to explore how much there is. So you know what? I guess we'll continue with this next time, so I'll see you guys then. Thanks for watching.